a sponge with me and some clear water and some colored water. Sorry, Tyler, it's your peach tea. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have that. It said grape juice or Kool-Aid. We didn't have anything. I'm going to use orange juice, but that was peach tea. <laughs> a little bit of color. Um, today we're talking about the soaking or filling of things, like the bad versus good in the world. So, I mean, sponges, they soak up things. Um, they can be used to clean, but they can soak up liquid. Um, and, um, actually, yeah, let's see. And I just have a little bit. Well, I put this in here. It's supposed to soak that up. I think I put too much in. So this turn orange. Um, and then um, when I squeeze it, say this is the good in the world. Um, I'll read about that later. And this is some of the bad stuff. Um, and then so when I squeeze this out, it dilutes it. It's I'm gonna do that the wrong way. <laughs> I squeeze that out. So whatever was bad in here, the good dilutes the bad. is already filled with the good stuff, then it can't hopefully not absorb too much of the bad stuff. Um, and um, so we can be that way too um, by trusting God. Uh, Romans 15, 13 um, as talks about being filled. I pray that God, the source of hope, will fill you completely with joy and peace because you trust in him. And he will overflow with confident hope, hope through the power of the Holy Spirit. Like this is the good stuff, the joy, the peace, the love. Um, and then it says, be filled with the Holy Spirit. Uh, be filled with God's word. Psalm 119.11 says, I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. So this is also God's word. You want to be filled with God's word and, and not be filled with some of the bad stuff in the world. Um, and be filled through, with God's presence through prayer. And Luke 6, 12 says, one of those days, Jesus went out to the mountainside to pray and spent the night praying to God. So when we are filled with his goodness and grace, we can rejoice. Um, okay. And um, another verse here, that was something else. But um, Therefore, since we have been made right in God's sight by faith, we have peace with God because of what Jesus Christ our Lord has done for us. Because of our faith, Christ has brought us into this place of highest privilege. And joyfully, we look forward to sharing God's glory. We can rejoice, too, when we run into problems and trials, for we know that they are good for us. They help us learn to endure. Um, and this expectation will not disappoint us, for we know how dearly God loves us because he has given us the Holy Spirit to fill our hearts with his love. Amen. So that's just a reminder to be filled with the good things. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.